All right, I'll show you my progress. Uh, I got thermos bottles. I got over a hundred of these things. Uh, but this is all straight. This is my one microwave. This goes to my easels when I paint outside. And look at the little oven. And this is. Here's my five-gallon bucket of cooking oil. Some food's in this one. I ain't got that separated yet. But it looks a lot better than it did. I filled up underneath that table. I go... But this table's full. I could actually walk down through here. And I could go all the way around. It reached up. Here's some more thermos models. And there's one right there. I got about a hundred of them. I collect them for some reason. Even coffee pots, I don't even drink coffee. I got one, two, three, four, five. There's one over there, six. I worked on my table pretty good. back up that way I got a little bit more straightening up in the kitchen uh, I got stuff stuff that are underneath there and that ta that table I bought I just didn't have no place to put it uh, but at least I can get to the appliance if I want to use one and and the pot the pan and the food I got a mountain of trash gonna carry out today I've got all these batteries left oops sorry Left over from my wheelchair and my RV, they could go outside. Because uh, when I exchange them, I got brand new ones right, excuse me, over right here uh, with my three in ones charger. And these are battery batteries there. They're still in the box. I'm sorry, I'm bouncing around. I'm proud of myself. I got a sciatic nerve that's kicking up. At least I can get around like and grab something like this I want to use or a stirring vessel. I got like two or three sets of these. Ugh, some small ones. Can't find the lid to this. It's here somewhere. And I can't find it. Uh, I found a bunch of box of spices I got to go through and see how old they are. Uh, I, I got another one of them I got to find. They go in the and this when it gets hot, they're like little water coolers. Paintings on the wall. I quit. I got started another painting. I'll show it to you later. Uh, my pots and pans you guys have seen. I got to clean off the stove and this counter down through here, which ain't gonna be bad. I got overflow of pots and pans and skillets. This is a mountain of trash it goes in. All that's trash. And then that thing goes somewhere. It goes in the front sunroom when I give it a space for it. But right now it's going to sit right there when I get through what I want to do. But it looks so much better. I can walk around in here. I can actually go all the way around the island. My scooter's pretty well cleaned off. All but a dustpan. I've got a couple of dustpans on them. Here's my Berkey filter, and this is my snow clone machine. This here is my little uh, uh, popcorn maker. See, we've got the big tray. I take that and have popcorn day for the kids and snow clones. Uh, I can actually walk around. That's my camping stuff right here that's got to go. This is a, a fold-out kitchen that goes in my camper. When I sit outside, it's got a sink and everything. This here, I, I had bought it from an old salesman. 
And what it does, it just tells you all kinds of different hinges and 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 and, and clasp. It's got all over, all different kinds. It's a little box. It's got it on the ends, on this end. But what it is, just a little box. I just, I just thought it was cute. Had all them different kind of clasps on it. Yeah, I buy the strangest damn thing. It's a salesman's sample. Uh, well, I'm, my hip is hurting so bad. But I, I got this here. This here has got to be put up. This right here, my tools. Uh, my starter, like a Jackery. Three and one's what it's called. And then my two new batteries. The old batteries has got to go outside. I kept in here so they wouldn't freeze, so I could exchange them for news. New batteries. They fit my wheelchairs, but they're dead. I got new wheelchair batteries. They didn't take the old ones, so I exchange them in when I buy a lot more batteries. <sighs> I've got that microwave and toaster oven over there, I call it. And then over here, <laughs> sorry, I got a little smaller microwave and another toaster oven, plus my big oven. <laughs> and then behind all this, <laughs> I've got uh, another toaster oven and uh, oh, it's a bagel cooker and a toaster oven. What's in that? It seems heavy. Oh, it's got that water and stuff. I got a leaking faucet. Drip, drip, drip. I saved the water. Uh, I got to clean this up. Got all my alcohols. And my sprayer. Oops. Sorry about it. It's my alcohol sprayer. Uh, and I'll walk around. Now, oh, let's see. Behind here, I gotta get, that's my little potty deal that goes in the ambulance. And underneath there is, oh, some more, uh, I thought that is the pot was under there. It still might be, because there's another pot back up in here. It's got the, the great big uh, crock pots. I've had this old shoe cookie jar belonged to my mother. Old woman had so many children she didn't know what to do, so she lived in a shoe. There's my ancient bird cage. It's got set so on a stand. I put it behind there to keep it out. People I'm packing it all. I gotta sort through a bunch of stuff. But at least I can walk around. Uh, this box here has got to be moved. Got my first aid kit that goes to the amulets. Just a box of miscellaneous stuff I bought. Perfumes. But I, I can at least sort through some stuff now. And I can get to that freezer with, if I want to get some water jugs off the, out of it. It's still working because I see the lights on. Uh, well, I'm going to go sit down and take my meds, but I thought I'd show you all kinds of crap. Yeah. Now this here is a wine. Oh, I got all my, uh, what do I call them, uh, wine jugs, I guess I call them. That is let shrunk leather over a bottle. And I... Uh, I got it probably in probably the West Indies. It's a rum bottle for rum. I don't know. I wanted the damn rum, and the bottle came cute, so I kept the damn bottle of drugs of rum. Uh, uh, that, now that's an old, old kerosene lamp. Still works, too. I gotta go. I keep saying that. There's my popcorn maker. And my stove, all this stuff. There's my little 
hot water tank I take camping. I unloaded a lot of stuff out of there last year because I was doing some remodeling in it. Uh, my clothes is right here. My laundry, I gotta get that in the bedroom. I mean, it's not perfect, but I could at least move around in it and grab something. That's an electric heater. Uh, uh, oh, what do I call it? Uh, humidifier and a little portable air conditioner. Uh, I got a whole shelf in the bedrooms, for, well, actually three shelves of thermos bottles. <laughs> uh, there's an old copper uh, canister set up there. And my stuff that I use for pies, cakes, and cookies and stuff when I go take it to somebody's house, all them plastic things. Yep, this is it. <laughs> I gotta sort through that. I think 90% of that's gonna be thrown away. I ain't gonna tell how old it is. I'm trying to look. I don't see no damn dates, but I'll smell of it. It ain't don't smell fresh, it's gone to the trash. I got a bunch of trash take out today. Here's my coffee that I buy. I don't drink coffee, but I coffee dye paper to put in my journals. There's a bunch of stuff under there I gotta do. That's dog food underneath there, big old bin of dog food. Holds thirty see it's about thirty pounds. It's full. My dogs got to eat. When they ain't eating chicken, I gotta clean the refrigerator out and give them chicken today. Uh, uh, yep. Mixers. Oh, I think if I can't find that uh, that Instapot, I think my granddaughter snatched it and using it. So I'll just get me another one. But I don't trust them. I like the old fashioned pressure cooker. There's some pecans. I bet they're 10 years old. <laughs> I'm throwing them away, but they're probably three years old. It's been three years since I guess I walked around in here. I had all this cleaned off three years ago. We didn't, uh, that wasn't back in there. It was all open in here. And, uh, well, it's been maybe five years ago. And my uh, kids came for Thanksgiving dinner. I think that was the last year my wife. Man, I might know, I'm 2013, who now knows. But I can get to some stuff. And I can get to these file cabinets. Got all kinds of stuff. Here's another stainless steel mixer. I got a whole bunch of hand mixers. Let's see what's in this one. Pots and pans and a pestle. I think that's a med med medicine pestle. Well, I think I showed you that stuff. I use these in my art. Them egg deals. I got some plastic ones, and that's a glass one. I, I kept it in case I want to make devil eggs. But all the plastic ones I used to mix paint with. Great idea for mixing colors. I ain't never used that mixer back there, and I ain't used, never used this juicer. Uh, blender juicer, whatever. I ain't even put the uh, drip faucet on it. Now this old mixer right here, oh, that, it took a lot. I've used the hell out of it. Uh, and I've used this one here. That's got a meat grinder kit that's in one of them drawers that goes on the back of it. Uh, a sausage maker or whatever you want to call it. I've used it. Here's another hand mixer. I usually just grab a hand mixer and mix it up. I ain't never used this red, this red, brand new mixer. I was gonna make bread one time, and I thought, well, I'll buy a bigger one this time. This whole thing here is, you've seen this day and that one there. I've used that one a little bit and this one here a little bit, but not like them two. This one here is the oldest one. Uh, I used the snow out of that thing. That's when it first came out. Then I got pots and pans. And 
I go clean off my kitchen and pots and pans and skillets and that's it. I my steamer I use anymore. I just use a microwave steamer. <laughs> Gotta go. Take care of yourselves.